Yo, what's going on, guys? It is Aesthetics Jamoni here. I'm at work, and uh, on a serious note, um, I wanted to make a little motivational video. Not really motivational, inspirational kind of, of my life and what struggles I have had that caused me to keep working and want to be better in life. And I'll remind you right now, I am going to the gym every day. I'm only 17 years old for the past couple of days. Um, and I have a job at a supermarket. I'm a courtesy clerk. I live with my family and I am as happy as can be. I love my life and I thank God every day for it. And uh, I want to show you guys, well, I want to tell you guys some of my struggles that I've had in my life. Okay, so a couple years ago, uh, my parents are strict on dating. They're very traditional European family. Um, and I was caught dating. And so the first time, it wasn't too bad. They just sat me down and talked to me, asked me what I wanted to do, what was my, like, why. And I literally just said, I don't know. And I ended up being stupid and dating another four times. But... It wasn't dating four different people. It was dating the same person. Um, and I got in trouble four times. And I just kept crawling back to her because I thought that I loved her. I was with her for 10 months. And then I was moved schools, which ended up being the best thing to ever happen to me. Um, at the time, I was very, very depressed. I was a seriously depressed teenager who was a boy who was going through puberty strongly strongly yeah and at the time i wasn't at the gym so i didn't have a way to get rid of all my anger pain and so i resorted in cutting myself on my wrists um a lot of people who are depressed feel the need to do that when i did it I felt like people would care about me again and I would actually be loved because at the time I felt like nobody loved me I felt like nobody really cared and I overdosed on my sister's medica medications as well um, my parents took me to the hospital and they told me if I took a little more of anything that I took um, I could have been mentally uh, damaged my brain could have been damaged forever or I could have been laying in a bed for the rest of my life and I thank God I thank you guys I thank my family for all that you guys have done whether it was restricting me from the things that I wanted to do telling me that I'm doing something wrong or helping me with something and I thought it was wrong I thank you so much because it got me to where I am right now and I'm as happy as can be. I have money coming from my job. I work with amazing people. I also work with people on YouTube. I help friends who ask me about workout tips, fitness tips, nutrition tips. And I've been making myself better lately. Um, I just had this lunch. It was a bunch of fruits and it was just a bunch of fruits. I didn't finish those apples right there as you could tell because I felt like I needed to do this on a serious note. And so after all that happened, I found out about the gym. Um, I started going to the gym with cuts on my wrists and people would look at me weird and I felt really bad about myself and I was scared and I didn't want people to look at me weird. And so I just kept working out. I kept going in long sleeve shirts so nobody would see. And after that, anybody who did cut or was feeling depressed, I did all that I could in my power, in my soul, to help them feel better as a person because nobody should go through something like that or self-harm or feel like they don't deserve to be here. Everybody was put on this earth for a reason. And I feel like my reason is to be a bodybuilder, help people, help their bodies be better and help them stay healthy and also just plain help them and make everybody happy. I love you guys and thank you for watching this video. 
If you liked it, please like, comment, and subscribe. And I will see you all in the next video.